pain, but I make it this fine. Me and my boss, I know we get this time. I ain't seen and know you want more. What you say? What you know, yeah. Pain, but I make it this fine. Me and my boss, I know we get this. Ask me why this vlog has no intro. Just, just ask me. <laughs> the fact that I'm laughing should let you know that everything from the beginning, during, and after this trip was a trip. Listen, when I tell you this trip nearly took me out, I should have known from the start. Let's, let's start from the top. Now, shame on me, I woke up at 5.30 and I had two things to do for work. So I left a little bit later than I should have, but I thought an hour and a half to get through everything should be good. I'm not going all the way to Europe, it's just to the States. Little did I know, my boarding pass wasn't digitized, which I thought was strange, but I didn't think much of it. I mean, things happen. I should have known, especially being legally blind. If it's not on my phone, there's a problem. I need to be able to pinch and zoom to see what I need to do, but I zoomed in on my phone on the screen to get a printed boarding pass. I never use those kiosks. Why is it that there's a little SSS on the thing? I hope you never come to know what that is. <laughs> Pretty much they take you to the side and they do another security check where they wand you down, they pat you down. I'm like, lady, I'm wearing aloe. There's literally nothing I can conceal. I try to pack light, but this time I was not packing light. I must have repacked 59,000 times to perfectly fit every piece I wanted to put in there. So for them to go through it haphazardly was giving me anxiety. It was just disturbing my spirit. Once I sat on my luggage to lock it back up, I was behind a 45 minute line. And when I say 45 minutes, I looked at my imaginary watch and I had 15 minutes to board my plane. Talk about anxiety. I got to the front of the line, I said, hey, I'm legally planning I need help finding my gate because with 15 minutes to spare, I can't be wandering anywhere. It wasn't just a matter of me not seeing, the ladies like, it wasn't just a matter of me not seeing, I came to find out that where the gate was was all the way over there. They popped me on a caddy, rushed me over, and I was the second last person to board the plane to the point where I don't even know if the last person boarded. But I made it, I did, phew, like a cartoon character. I was so relieved and I said, thank the Lord. I do some opening scenes, some B-roll, some aesthetic shots. I do my intro. Then I get to my cousin's house and I tell you why I'm there and what I hope to experience. SD card cleared out everything before I left. The camera likes to corrupt ever so often. So I had to decide, do I format and lose everything or do I try to transfer it? My cousin doesn't have a computer, so she suggested we go to her friend's workplace and transfer it. Two hours later, I thought the files were transferred, but poof, in the ethers, it's gone. No intro. Everything got bumped two hours, so I was trying to see the sunset and give you guys an aesthetic seascape, not seascape, cityscape. I'm thinking of my next trip. Tell me why! By the time we find the bar, 45 minutes of driving around, and then we find parking, another 15 minutes, we get there in our high heels, with high hopes, only to be told by the security guard they closed 10 minutes ago. You can't make this ish up. I lost my pearl earring and I'm like, this was a baptism gift, so we need to find it. I don't want to admit how many hours I spent looking for that thing, but thank the Lord I found it. Then what else went wrong? Because there was at least <laughs> The fact that there were seven things that went wrong on this trip is a trip. We were supposed to go to an all white event the last day. It got flooded out and relocated. We got locked in the garage on the way of going to the next place. And when we got there, we were the first and they were still setting up. So we're like, uh-uh, this is not the vibe. We went to Atlantic Station to eat and the food was busting. It was so good. Until I ate a piece of shrimp and there was a long hair in there and it wasn't mine because it was lodged, lodged in and they didn't want to comp it. I just, I can't vibe with the unhygienic-ish. Then I made this joke, like I don't want to go, the A belongs in the A, I wish my flight got canceled. I was just joking. You know all the times I want to speak things into reality? This was not one of those times. I had to go home. I get to the airport, it's uncharacteristically calm. You know what happened? Of course you know what happened. My flight got canceled. There's rain in New York City. I said, what does NYC have to do with me? I live in the six. Oh, forgot geographically, you have to pass through it. So they said my flight would be 24 hours later. Well, they were wrong. It was actually delayed four times the next day. But honestly, the people that work at Air Canada, chef's kiss, exceptional customer service. Shout out to Danielle and Mary. Is there even Mary? I can't remember. I'm so grateful for them because with everything that was going on, it was just nice to feel a sense of security. Like one of them waited with me until my cousin looped back to make sure I got in the right car. Like she didn't have to do all that. I got home at 2 a.m. I was tired working the next day. So let's run through the roster. Flight delayed, flight canceled, event flooded, hair in my food, 
camera broke. Did I even tell you? The camera broke the last day. We made it almost two years. We had a good run, but I'm done. $1,200 later, I'm talking to you guys on a new camera. I did not expect to spend that much coins that soon. When you see what we got into, it was still a good time. I'm so happy I went there for Carnival. I'm so happy I got to see family. I'm so happy I got to have the experience I had with the vision I have. So at the end of the day, hey, you gotta let me know what your favorite moments are to make this vlog worth it. I'm glad that we made it. And let's get into it. So. How much is parking? It's none of your business. Let's just do the all white because we did. Let's be walking. <laughs> You're gonna do voiceovers? Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Music. No waving. She is for Diva. She's the owner of Lady Couture Petite. Today we are here to see the lovely botanical garden in it. It really just smells like flowers here. It's just so relaxing and we're excited to show you guys. I love it, the cute little bag. Hi, Kitty, how are you? But you can't come on the bridge with me, okay? All right, when you grow up. I love that she's watching. <laughs> That's a snake? Look. No. That's the head of the snake. Oh, I thought you meant a real snake. No, and then look. I was going to have a heart attack. It, you see. There better not be no real it's snakes a, it's here. A, uh, climb on the corn snake sidewalk. Oh, this is lovely. If I lived here, I would come here to meditate all the time. We are in a plant wonderland. <laughs> With your head. That's what it says? So cool. Sheesh. See it? Yeah. Right there. Oh my gosh. We have to stay in a glass case. Whoa, poisonous frogs moving on the ground. You see? So that's this why there's a glass case. Poisonous. Look. It is so humid in here. I love it. And I don't usually like humidity, but this is rainforest vibe. Right. I love that it's just by itself here. Yes. It's called a monster because it grows like a monster. <laughs> Tell me this isn't the perfect way to start a vacay. And not my cousin in the background. She's helped at least 10 pairs of people take their photos. She is so thoughtful and so helpful. Who Hodges Bay, not you. <laughs> It is. Yeah. It really just, it really is. One thing about me, I always make a mess with popsicle. He recommended chocolate and sea salt. I don't like chocolate. Unless it's chocolate, but this is good. The water's coming out of her. I'll see you in editing. So it's not blind friendly here? I'll say yes and no because 
I don't take public transportation. I've seen people on public transportation, but it's like you have to live in certain neighborhoods to to to, to take public transportation. Like where I reside, there's absolutely no public transportation. Um, especially like in areas like Stockbridge, they signed a petition that they don't want any public transportation in the area because to them, public transportation they don't means want peasants. A certain I'm not a peasant though. So they want to know that people are responsible, drive pay their insurance so they, they a certain mentality I don't know. That's yeah sad. so for them people on the bus is like uh we don't want Ugh, bus that's people. terrible <laughs> i'm a bus person but not by choice i know so I there's know. so many places here i could never live it needs to get better cell phone plans i'm a wi-fi bandit which means i can't just turn on gps white right now to find where this cafe is and i can't see well enough to see the signs Every time I go up to something thinking it is what it is, I zoom in and it isn't what it is. That's my first ballet experience, but is it usually $20 or something crazy? Yes. Right? I got you, don't worry about it. My glasses are finally getting fixed. That is some of the best salmon I've ever had in my entire life. Wait, 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 wait. One more, one more. Okay, you gotta show you. and when you wear heels, you go up and down. Because I've okay. tried to do it before. I move around? No, you can't move. I can't move? Yeah. Okay. Originally, I was going to wear a bubble skirt to brunch, but I feel like this is more fitting. I've been wanting to wear this vest, as you can tell, for a little while. I love it. I'm so glad vests are back. I'm also going to switch it up for another vest, possibly the next thing we're doing after brunch. I'm super excited to take you guys to Toast. I'm excited to go to Toast. I've been hearing about Toast for years. And even, Vanessa, you've never been to Toast, right? No. Yeah, but she's heard about it too. I think Dwayne has been once, and that's who we're going with, who you've seen in another vlog in the past, if you've gone back. I thought that I was dreaming when you said you left me. Don't judge the hair, it's humid out there, it's about to rain. We are at the infamous Toast on Lennox. I am so hyped to try this. And like I told you this morning, look in the back. Hey, how are you doing? How are you? I'm doing great. No chance to prepare. Did you record for me in Toronto? I feel like you did though. I did. Look how Alicia say cheese. I'm still be like a new When I tell you this is the best chicken waffles I've ever had in my life, and you know I'm a chicken waffle connoisseur. Hands down. That drink is too strong though. I never complain about too much alcohol in a drink, but for this time of morning, and for me being a lightweight, she she said it. It's DNA! Just the extra. <laughs> We are in Lenox Mall, not too far from Toast, just taking a little break since it was pouring rain earlier today and you know our natural hair girlies cannot take that. 
I'm just gonna run a return for Duena. I already went to Sephora to see if they have Brown Girl Jane and they do not. And then there's somewhere else we need to go and hopefully I remember before we leave here. We would wear that too anywhere. Outside. Um, so there's a girl who stays inside and studies. The sun is shining, now it's time for round two. I'm gonna bump my hair real quick because the humidity got to it. But first, should I wear white shorts or green shorts? Actually, that's my best from this morning, Never mind. Where are they? Thinking about this, since we're going to the carnival festival, I don't really do colors much. I'm always in my monochromatics, but I figure this is good for the festivities. Or if I want to keep it in my neutral hues. Oh, shucks, I packed the wrong one. I wish you guys could pick in real time and help me because I don't got that much time. So the longer we're here, the less we're out there. And I came for the vibes in a good time. I think I'll wear that. See what I mean? There's a lot. I think I like this. Such a sucker for a neutral. While we're here, quickly show you. This kind of feels thick. And if tomorrow's supposed to be as hot as forecasted, oh mercy. Got some thick clasps on the side. It might actually be too long for tomorrow. Very similar to one that I got at Zara, and I wish I kept that one because, hey, the price was afforded this. This is a two-piece set, because you know I'm a sucker for a good two-piece. So this goes, I don't even know. I wish this came with instructions. This is definitely a new pin. Cause I don't have the hip, the hip. I'm so excited to wear this on Monday. Memorial Day, wait. Enough, enough. Let's get going. Shut down the music out here in stage. If you're a masquerader, you already have your bands. The entertainment is inside, so make your way. When I tell you that was the longest line of life, but we made it. So Give a round of applause for me now. Sometimes oh, 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 you say everything. Put up your flash. Ladies, set your pocket just in case they show. Need some room to party. I want to see all my jump and wave people on this line here. We going in. Let me make sure my DJ in place. Show some love for the queen, the culture, Empress, Empress. Somebody say yeah, yeah. Bring the lights. Many islands. One Caribbean. Every time I go off fed some girl man and some man girl always approaching me saying I want a man and thing. Listen, a thousand dollars was found on a rubber band. If you come backstage right now, we have the rubber band. 
Where the thousand? Is what I see you talking about. See, I rubber band. And when I say you can't do it with kids, you gotta like, like when you got to this one here. How many of them are there? We have arrived at the St. Regis. We have arrived at the St. Regis. We need to get to the fourth floor for our reservation in the garden room. I'll let you know if it comes highly recommended like the select last night. It smells good. You know I love an airport. Airport? A hotel lobby scent. I guess where the music is? Ain't this what you came to see? Let me be your muse I'll inspire you And make you won't believe Fifty shades and hues Paint a maid for you Told me you didn't get what you started Put your hands on your feet in my body, my body Go ahead and push up on me you guys in the morning good morning we are gonna go on the infamous Ferris wheel I mean I don't know how infamous it is but it was on my list so I'm happy that we're able to go up well you'll see the views I'll be able to see I think Alicia will be able to see realistically Thank you. Hey, how you doing? How's your day? Doing good. Look at my head. I'm very short. <laughs> it's like you shouldn't put music and stuff over it. Right? Yeah. Whenever I hear it. Whenever. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> giddy giddy. I'm so happy I made this. Get the views. Excuse. <laughs> okay, guys. Next time you come, I'll take you in the night, okay? <laughs> here I am just looking out of the horizon of life, it's life in life and when I say to myself, self, I can't relate it to her. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's just the voices in my head. <laughs> it's time and it's 11.09. What's your longest quest? Demented. Well, I like going to go wrong. One more. So beautiful up here. It's 
such a green city. Yeah, I find it very green. Very green. It used to be called um, City in the Forest. Like that. City in the Forest. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, okay. I'm a savages. Right. They need two new Fee in the drive thru is all good. Okay, we're just about to go into Rum Punch Sunday. I am so exhausted, even though I had an iced coffee. It was really, really good. I wish I could nap, but unless I'm in a moving vehicle, there's nap. <laughs> That was fun, guys. Now it's time for bed. I'm glad that I am completely sober. I didn't get to try any of the food truck food. What we ate earlier today had me full. I wish I got a smaller portion. Then I would have been able to try a little bit. But that's okay. That's what next time is for. So I'll see you guys in the morning. That's not my problem. You asked me to help you serve food. I was like, oh, maybe Janessa will get to sleep in. Yeah, right. We made a mad dash. I actually kept this on my head because I was not about to ruin my hair. Does that rain out there? You saw it. It is treacherous. So I'm back at Danessa's and she's going to chef up some breakfast. <laughs> And because it's raining, there is nothing left for us to do. Ah. So we're just going to chill. Exactly. Time to exactly. We're going to chill, and then there's an all white party to send me off. So keep it low key. It's just an excuse to come back another time. So I'm frying my uh, banana fritters using coconut oil, it's healthier. I'm not a master chef, but. <laughs> My cousin, I will become a master chef. <laughs> Bad this past winter, it barely snowed. It was the mildest one we've had in years. I don't know when I like rationalize what kind of cold is better than some other kind of cold. Because <laughs> <laughs> the math ain't mathing, okay? I don't want to be in Toronto anymore anyway. You don't want to be what? In Toronto anymore anyway. Not a lot of them, actually. 
Yeah. Rural is ignorant, but you know. Don't worry, I didn't know what it meant. <laughs> I thought it was something bougie. I was like, ooh, I live in rural. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> Did you hear me, Jay? Yeah. I'm over here like, yes, I live in a rural. Ooh, it's bougie over here. Yes, rural. <laughs> sounds boo sounds French. Rural. <laughs> Lord of mercy. <laughs> my my vocabulary didn't catch that word, so I was like, "Oh yes, I live in the, the rural." Yes, no, 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 rural is not good. It's dead. So I'm in, I'm in Austin. It's it's very chill. We're very nerdy, you know, and I need that. So can we get into trouble? But yeah. I don't know. They said just this little thing. You're supposed to take it out. I don't know. You know, people, not everyone does, but. Yeah, I didn't even know that was a thing until today. <laughs> the more you know. The ancestors have said, you know, just the rice of the egg you take out. I guess I just follow their teachings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So Kendrick uh, really did win the beef. I'm I'm not gonna be cleaning to Kendrick. So they need to see like certain action has you know consequences. I have a cleaning business, I have an online boutique and then um my house I turned it into a crash pad so I rent rooms out to the flight attendants. I will have nightly stay or weekly stay, you know. like I said I get it how I get it. Okay, so, so. Yeah, and then I'll be out here scam scamming these rich niggas in the streets. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> if you're approaching me like a gentleman, then I'm gonna treat you as such. But if you disrespect me, I'm disrespecting you. Yeah, yeah. And then you have guys that I just automatically meet are that pretty, but I I I tend to not pay days. Oh baby, I was getting them. So pretty. Mm -hmm. Alicia's like feeling very uncomfortable. Like, don't tell Jay that you're a scammer. <laughs> you're not a scammer. I'm not though. a scammer. I work very hard, but again, if they disrespect me, I'm, I'm gonna get at them. Oh wow. But then again, that was in my heydays. I slowed down now. Fine for me, thank you. <laughs> anyway, Jay, <laughs> it was nice talking to you, and I'm not a hoe, okay? Just in case you. No, 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 no. There are men out there that just give women money. I mean, eventually they're expecting something in return, but the trick is you get how much you can get quick. So by the time he asks you, hey, okay, keep it moving. Next. Yeah, something like that. Turn to your home. Right. You can tell. I love to do And you even changed the cutlery. I took it and I'm like, this is not the gold cutlery. Yeah, I changed, but now I'm mad at it because the it's gold. It's iridescent. I wanted you to have a matching spoon to sweeten your tea. Is your tea sweet enough? Do yeah, you want my more sugar good. and stuff? No, it's all good. Okay. I don't usually add sugar to my coffee. Okay. Or tea. These are really good. Mm-hmm. If I do say so myself. Mm hmm God, the rain has stopped. I'm gonna do a little bit of morning yoga because it wouldn't be a morning without yoga. I try to work out every single day, even when I'm on day, okay? So we're just gonna do this. Day four. Dun -dun -dun. Take these off. Just a super quick yoga fit yoga fit session because <laughs> my leg is hurting i don't know why the left side hasn't been feeling right for like the last two years and sometimes it just starts feeling really tense and sore so i'm not going to do that much but let me get to this so we can get to the rest of the day okay i like to set my phone it's close enough so i can see and Ooh. I'm tired already. I feel like you guys are at such a good angle. What is this pushback of business? Party 
how close it's in the back. See? Take the exit. <laughs> Last adventure <laughs> in the A. And now the sun is out. It's perfect. Damn bipolar ass weather. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'd rather leave with the sun than the thunderstorm. Right. Because there's no way I want to be stuck in that airport with delay on delay on delay on delay on delay. Yo, it's the worst. It is. It's Just go ahead and tell me cancel and exactly. I'm flying you out in the morning. I would love that. Then, boom, we good on that. Yeah. But I don't wish. hit me with no delays, 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 delays. I was, I was at the Orlando to... airport for eight hours once. I was supposed to be going to Miami a few weeks ago. Mm -hmm. And the flight just kept getting delayed from 10 to 2 in the morning. I just left the Miami last night here. You need a voucher, right? No, I didn't. Oh. I guess flights within the states are cheap, but that's not the case in Canada. Uh -huh. Yeah, it was like round trip, like $50. Wow. You from could Canada. definitely go home on that. From here to Florida. Yeah, oh, wish. Miami. Oh, wish. Oh, wish. That's definitely not the case. I've never gotten a flight for less than $200. And the only time it was $200 was from Madrid to Lisbon, so within that continent. Wow. You can't fly anywhere in Canada for under $600, because I know Vancouver is like $1,200, and that's the only place I want to go. Montreal oh, yeah. is like four, but when you think about it, you could drive there in five hours, so why would you so, pay $400 for a flight? Right. It's expensive in Canada. The perks are not perking. It's expensive. It's getting expensive any, everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. And Atlanta expensive. never used to be so expensive. Back in the day, like maybe my house was like $150,000. Now my house is over $300,000. It's like double. That's good. Then it's worth it to buy. Yeah, but it would have been nice to still <laughs> buy it at $150,000. You know? And then, it, and then it can go up. Yesterday's price is not today's price. It's not. You're definitely, it's definitely not going to get what you're getting before. We're going with Miss Hot Stuff over here. What? Are you seeing that? Okay. Okay. Yeah, good. Stunner. Right? <laughs> nice. She's so beautiful. Yeah, yeah, she definitely is. My cousin is not impressed at all. Only in Atlanta. So this is Atlantic Station. Oh, hold on. Not my camera breaking. Oh yeah, correct. Yeah. Like, really nice. uh, like sweat within like, five minutes. Miami is where you can't breathe. Because it's like humid there, right? This is hot. I'm fed or I'm sorry. And half off, half off told me like she's like sitting here disgusted, thinking of whatever else could have been in her food. And I'm not being a like complainer, but that is unacceptable. That's hygienic. Yeah, yeah they should be wearing hair nuts and stuff. It was so like, what's not it was, happening if she it was inside of her food that she had to pull it out of her food. So we don't even know. Y'all only saw the end part there. of it. You, you don't even know what else was contaminated in her food. Now the food was excellent. Ex we, we will be back. We will be back. I probably have two meals, the lamb and the, the chicken, the, the shrimp. But I just think that that was unacceptable. And I think you should be more food. Thank you, Kai. What? Slap your mother good? Slap your mother good. Now, the sunrise. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's still thing happening here, right? I think it's I'm too disgusted and want to control everything. What's happening? <laughs> I mean you're in her vlog. Because people are revolting. <laughs> I think the last time I came to the States was Did you say guy and star? No, I'm not a man them. The Toronto man's accent is horrible. I don't say any of that stuff. You guy, you star. Choose differently, my G. That's how they talk. It's so bad. Um, I'm trying to remember. I think it was Miami nine years ago. All right, hot Lana, it's been real.
<laughs> Undecided museums and different stuff. So I think after we bust a curve, mm -hmm. we should see some nice cafe stuff. So when I told Vanessa that I wanted to go to the botanical garden or the belt line, she's like, mm -hmm, we chose right the first day. <laughs> it's still really beautiful here, but the botanical garden has something magical and special mm -hmm. about it. This reminds me of a couple of the trails in Toronto, but I like that this part is completely concrete, so you're not walking on rubble or sand or dust. It's very much stop off somewhere, have a latte, stop off somewhere, have a drink, go with your friends afterwards, but maybe shower because you want to smell like outside after. <laughs> that part. <laughs> I know, it's here. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see it. <laughs> they definitely want to monitor and maintain. Ponds City Market. You see you? I am your tour guide. The cocktails and alcohol? In a, in a popsicle. Oh. You want one? Alcohol popsicle? Girl, yes. You want me to go on the plane lid, lid? <laughs> no, get down. Uh, no, it's just pops. We make mixed drinks with pops. Oh, you make mi mixed drinks with pops. Yeah, that's what the apple uh, tip is. They had another one you showed me yesterday. It's a total market. The street young and innocent. Today, is it cold? Yeah, so it's on it or on the side. Sauce on it, please. Jamaica, Jamaica. Jamaica, Jamaica by the airport. Let's see. It's going to be on our list of recommended. Thank you. You're welcome. Moment of truth. Oh, it's good, girl. I believe you. It smells good. Yeah, I don't even play them games. Look at that. Used to make you rock away. And that was just mine. Yeah, please take it out. No, right I will. When I tell you this is good, it's tender, very spicy. My mouth is burning. Juicy. Seasoned through and through. I'm a little bit bougie, so I wish there were less bones, but all in 9 out of 10. And all you hear is all of us crackling. <laughs> How do you like the Pop Rocks? I thought it was meth. I thought it was drugs. Lord of mercy. Sun setting on another day. I'm just here waiting to board the plane. Well, hopefully, because you know what happened yesterday. But I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here. I pray that the second half on my iPhone isn't as janky as it looks to me, but hopefully editing Alicia can do something about it. But until next time, stay safe, stay sane, stay blessed. Love and later. Always the first on the plane.